chapter 96 to 97. Be hopeful, O righteous ones, for the sinners will suddenly perish before you, and you will have authority over them as you wish. And on the day of the tribulation of sinners, your children will mount up and ascend like eagles, and your nest will be higher than the vulture. And you will climb up, and you will enter the crevices of the earth, and the clefts of the rock forever, like the coney before the wicked ones. And they will sigh because of all of you, and weep like sirens. However, do not fear you who have suffered, for you will receive healing, and a bright light will shine upon you, and you will hear a sound of rest from the heavens. Woe to you, O oh sinners! For your riches make you appear to be righteous, but your heart convicts you of being sinners. And this word will be a testimony against you, a memorial of evil works, Woe to you who devour the finest of the wheat and quaff wine from the mixing bowl while you tread on those who are lowly with your might. Woe to you who drink water at all times for suddenly you will be repaid and you will become exhausted and wither away because you have forsaken the fountain of life. Woe to you who commit iniquity and deceit and revilement. It will be a memorial against you for evil. Woe to you, O oh mighty ones, who oppress the righteous with might. For the day of your destruction will come in those days, many good days will come to the righteous ones in the day of your judgment. Take courage, O righteous ones, for sinners will become an object of contempt and will be destroyed on the day of iniquity. Let it be known to you that the Most High has your destruction in mind, and that the messengers of the heavens will rejoice at your destruction. And what will you do, O sinners? And to where will you flee on that day of judgment when you hear the sound of the prayer of the righteous ones? And you will not be like them, for this word will be a testimony against you. You have been companions of sinners. And in those days, the prayer of the righteous ones will reach the Lord. But for you, the days of your judgment will come. And all the accounts of your lawless deeds will be read out in the presence of the Great Holy One, and your face will be put to shame. Then he will remove all the works which have partaken in the lawlessness. Woe to you, O sinners, who are in the midst of the sea and upon the dry land! The memorial against you is evil. Woe to you who acquire gold and silver, but not from righteousness, and speak, We have become rich with riches, and we have obtained possessions, and we have acquired all which we have desired. And let us do whatever we desire. 
because we have gathered up silver in our treasuries and many good things in our houses and they are poured out like water. You err, because your wealth will not remain. Instead, it will quickly ascend from you, because you have acquired everything unrighteously. And you will be delivered up to a great curse.